Hey Jeffers County, welcome back. It's part four. Mm -hmm. It's been a good month and hopefully you joined us. We're back with the last of our planting. So we've been talking all month about how to regrow your kitchen scraps. Yes, and today we're going to go ahead and plant that pineapple. And like we talked about last week, you can leave it out for a couple days at least, or even up to a whole week. And so all we're going to do is plant this bottom portion of the top of that pineapple. Pack that in. Give us some water, water and we're good. And that's it. All right. That's all you have to do is wait three years. <laughs> wait three years. So <laughs> let's talk soil for a little bit, Drew. So it does need a way to drain. Yes. So that is very important with a pineapple. If you let that soak, it will rot. Those roots, pineapple is very susceptible to root rot. And so it can get a little funky if you leave it too wet. So make sure you have a well-drained soil, well-drained medium that you're doing. So if you're doing soil, if you don't have holes in the bottom, put some rocks in there, put some newspaper in there, something to help that water drain off the soil. Mm -hmm. Yes, something so it won't clog up those holes in the bottom. All right, are you ready for a new food? No, let's do it. All right, so, this week we have celery, and it's probably, I would say, probably one of the easiest things to do, but it's also a great vegetable to do. Yes. It's easy, you can pull it out of the refriger refrigerator. It's great for your digestive system. It's loaded with those vitamins and minerals that we're all needing, right? Yes. And it's one of those foods that still helps with your inflammation. So, easy breezy. I have two of them here going on. I'm gonna let Drew talk about them though. Yes, this is super easy, very, <clears throat> very similar to the green onions that we did at the, to start this series off. And you're just going to chop off what you're normally going to use with the celery anyway, using your soup, making your soups or whatever else you may be putting it into. And then you're just gonna take that little top and place it into some water where it's standing upright. And you can already see right here that there is tons of great growth. So I've had these in water since about the second week of March. So that's been two, three weeks. Yep. Um, it's one of the first ones that I kind of started. But just like the green onions, we want to wait until we see that root, root growth. So we've got a couple of big, good ones oh, going. Beautiful roots right? going right here. And so we're just going to go ahead and take that in our makeshift. Uh, I love to recycle things. Oh, it's the best. It means things don't end up in the landfills. Yes. We're just going to stick that down to where the roots are down. And we have that nice green up top. We're gonna to pack that soil around it and then give it a good watering and that's about it. And that's really all you have to do. And the celery is gonna take off really well. Now you can harvest it a couple different ways. With celery, you can wait about four months and you'll have a full stock of celery. Or you can just cut a little bit off as you go and just use little chunks of celery, whatever you're using your so purpose So just like our it. green onions. Just like the green onions okay. and it'll keep growing. And by snipping it, you will actually encourage a lot of that to grow. Awesome. We will post pictures. I've got them of our onions and our garlic. They are great. So we'll post pictures here in just a little bit so that you can see all those. But thank you so much for joining us this month. And get out and grow something. Have it's fun. that time. We've only shown a couple of different plants that you can grow from your groceries. There is a host of plants in your grocery store in your pantry that you can utilize. And if you have any questions, please contact your county extension agent. If you're in Chavez County, I look forward to hearing from you. Call Drew. <laughs> and so uh, remember to have fun, go out and plant it. And in the famous words of a former boss of mine, plant it, it'll grow. Thanks for joining Mostly. us. <laughs> Bye. Bye.